Greetings in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, and our soon coming King. Now, I want to finish this topic because the last time that I tried, it did not go through because of signal problem and other stuff that comes up. But nevertheless, as you see my topic, that qualities a lady or a woman love to see in a man or her husband. Now, this is for all male figure that desired a woman. Which means that qualities a woman look, look for in a man or in a, in a man. Share this with your husband, share this with your share this with your husband share this with your man because i realize that a lot of men are failing because they don't know the quality a female looking for in a man or wife looking for in a husband and i'm i, I want to help in this is a counseling session in such a way such as teaching session he that find out a wife, find it a good thing. He that find out a wife, find it a good thing. Qualities a woman or a lady love, love to see in a man. The first thing that a woman love to see, the first quality a woman love to see in a man or a lady love to see in a man is that he love God. Yes, a real woman love to see when her man, when a man or her husband love God. Because the more your husband love God, the more God, who is the creator of love, will pour out knowledge and wisdom and teach the man how to love his wife or his lady. So that's why a lot of ladies love to see when time her man love God because God is the one that create love that's the source that's the fountain mm -hmm. now that's one and next quality an next quality that a woman love to see in her man or in her husband or a man that is looking for a lady to be involved with the second one is that a woman love to see when her man or her, or her husband have strong responsibility or responsible. Now, a lot of these men are not responsible. And that will fatigue or frustrate a lot of ladies out there when your partner is not responsible. It's like he's acting like a irresponsible person. So... A woman love to see when her man qualities, qualities a woman love to see in her man is that he have strong responsibility or responsibility, right? A next quality a woman, a, a lady love to see in her man is that strong present. A woman love to see that when she has a man in her life, he is strong presence right strong presence a next quality that a lady love to see in her man or in her husband is that maturity maturity is very key in relationship nobody don't want to marry somebody that act like a local premature baby nobody want to involve with somebody that is a premature baby why am I saying that? Because maturity comes with great responsibility. Maturity, which means that you are no longer a child, but now you become a man. So you take up a manhood responsible responsibility, right? To how to act, how to behavior, how to act. In terms of, let me get a typical example. When you are mature, you know how to deal with problems. Which means that a lady is looking for a man that is so mature that when they have disagreement, the man don't run go to his mother. 
The man don't run go to his sister. The man don't run go to his court. They learn how to deal with the problem as to mature adults. So a woman loves to see when her man is mature. So that's a quality that ladies are looking for. Greetings to everybody, my spiritual daughters. Greetings, greetings also to my wife as well, who is covering me at this point. Right? A next quality a woman love to see in her man. This is this is very important. And if a lady don't see these qualities in her man, or 90% in her man, she's going to leave your man. Let me say it again. If a lady don't see these qualities in her husband or in her man that she want, they're not they're there, then they're not going to stay with you. You're going to have problems. And when I'm talking quality, let me let me say this before I continue. It's not every woman love money. It's not every woman love money. So you're going to say quality is woman, woman love money. I'm not talking about money. I'm not talking about your wealth. I'm talking true qualities that a woman love to see. Right? Either find out a wife, find out a good thing. But you have to learn the qualities a woman looking for now quality a woman love to see in her man or in a man is that he is confident in confidence in in his in his approach towards her confidence in his in in in, in his speech or how we verbalize or we communicate with her so confidence go a far away when a woman is looking for strong qualities in that i'm talking of you know, real ladies real woman looking for in her man is that he is confidence greetings to everybody again that is on the platform share the life with your uncle with your father with your with with your nephews i'm trying to help with even your husband i'm trying to help you guys I'm trying to help the male figure that they can look into themselves and see and see what I'm saying. An ex quality, an ex qualities a woman love to see in a man. Next quality a woman love to see in her man is that purpose in life. Let me say it again. Qualities a woman love to see in her man. One of the main qualities them that a woman love to see in a man or in her husband is purpose in life. How can you be involved with a, a man? Man, men, male. You, why? You must have a purpose in life. Every woman must. Should, why do you in a relationship in the first place and you don't have a, a purpose in life? It's like you're a deadlock. Morning, my daughters. Morning, my spiritual daughters. Morning, my spiritual sons. Morning, 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 morning. I'm tr this is listen. You will not find this topic being taught in churches or taught by a pastor or taught by a leader. And this is why a lot of divorce has been occurring. Our relationship never lasts, right? Because these are qualities that. Ladies are real women are looking for in a man, right? Purpose in life. How can we have you and your individual in a relationship male and there is no purpose in life? So ladies is look looking for a purpose in a man. Mm, their dreams to accomplish, right? Um a next quality is a woman love to see in her man or in her husband is that honesty and trustworthy honesty goes a long way in relationship and this is what breaks up a lot of relationship because there's no honesty in the relationship and there's no trustworthy in the relationship and it's very simple and be honest I am going down the street on at my auntie. Be honest. 
be honest be honest be trustworthy and one of the things that destroy a lot of relationship is um password on your phone and that has destroyed a lot of a lot of relationship i mean it's like they have a second both male and female um have a second female in in their life which is the phone but that's a different topic right there and i always say this my significant can answer my phone anytime and if any human being called in me and my wife can't answer the phone don't call me if any female that is calling my phone and my wife can't answer the phone don't call me if any male is calling my wife and i can't answer the phone don't call her what am i saying because sometimes these things break up trust in relationship it sounds strange it sounds simple but it's true i am not hiding anything so she, she have all right to answer because like for instance now i am busy i am in the bathroom and the phone is ringing she can answer the phone same thing with my significant if she is busy washing the clothes or busy talking uh, i'm reason with somebody i can answer the phone trustworthy trustworthy sometimes we destroy the relationship so qualities a woman love to see in a man honesty and trustworthy and it's quality a woman love to see in her man or in her, in her husband is is strength both physical and mental right they want to know that their partner is physically strength and that's why it's good for a male to be exercised do look at push-ups do look at abs you don't have to go to a gym you can do that in your spare time right um walk the scheme right build your health build your physical strength because a woman doesn't want to walk with her partner and then him just drop down just like that she want to ensure that her partner is physically in shape and also mentally in shape so mental mental is very important because let me get a typical example a lot of male break down because they can't take the pressure of life could be jobs and and a woman tired a woman will be easily tired um if you're not men you are physically strong but you are mentally disabled you may because of certain stuff you don't want to go back to work you may because of certain pressure you don't want to do no job uh you may because of losing a loved one um the relationship with your wife or with your man begins to break down begins to deteriorate I mean a woman love to see when her man is mentally which means the inner man is mentally mm, strong right um so no matter if you're going through stress depression men a woman love to see when you can overcome um trials um 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 situation sorry issues situation a woman love to see that in a man trust me it's a great quality if you can overcome the pressures of life the next qualities a woman love to see in her man or in her husband and this is facts you know i'm telling you, you know facts is a woman love attention bad they love attention they love to be cuddled they love to be ensure that and when i'm talking about attention it's very important men a woman love attention how when them say they don't want it they want it it just testing your ability now if you give your mother more attention than your woman you're gonna in a trouble if you give your children more attention than your woman or than your husband sorry than your wife my my apology you're going to in trouble if you give more attention even that's why you always have to give them much attention both publicly because you can't give your woman attention privately and don't give her publicly you're going to be in trouble right because 
they, 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 they it's like it's like they can't do without water they are looking for it attention is a must for them you're on your phone but still give them attention try find somewhere to give them attention right you can't just and when i'm talking i'm not it's not only movies movies alone you know. it's not only with your mother or your sister you're giving them also if you're watching sports when you're even watching sports let me get a typical example of myself even when i'm studying the word of god and my 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 significance wants my attention sometimes yes i'm in the word but i have to have the a sense that although i'm studying the word of god she need me so what am i saying is that you have to study your partner so much to know when they want attention right and it's a balance but i'm mostly dealing with the men it's a balance teaching this that i'm teaching you right but because i'm te dealing with the qualities of a lady a real woman or a real lady love to see in a man that's why i don't deal i want they would teach and the men what a woman what a man want to see into a woman i will teach on that but because i'm dealing with the what are the qualities a woman love to see in a man that's why right so a woman love attention bad bad publicly mm -hmm. so when you're going out always ensure that your eyes is fit fix on your woman don't look across left and all right is one thing i can tell about a woman they are very attentive and they will see when your eyes begin to shift men men husband they will see when your eyes begin to shift and in public you will be tested you will be tried to see if you look out a road or you look over the fence and, and i'm telling you facts and i'm telling you straight up right qualities a woman love to see in her man loving a woman love this listen just when you're loving a woman love that they love to see that hey you don't only love her in private but you also love her in public and a lot of men fail that task because they want to have all the love but when them see them co-worker when them say um a ex-girlfriend or something like that they begins to don't want to show love no a woman crave for it they crave for the love so loving is very important whether it's privately and whether it's publicly right they love to have that the next qualities a woman love to see in her man or in her husband is respect respect Man, you have to choose your words very keenly and carefully how you speak because your words is something that you can't when you speak it you can't hold it back and respect you can't invite somebody to your home and don't let her know because remember that you know both of you are sharing the apartment or the space and if you're going to invite someone it could be a family relative it could be your daughter it could be your 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 nephews it could be a child it could be your mother it is it's a great respect if you allure her by saying it to her and get her point of view same thing goes for the vice vice versa so respect goes a far way and you have to learn to dance a yard with respect before you can dance abroad with respect so respect goes a far way so that's a quality that a woman love to see in her man or in her husband and next um qualities a woman love to see in her partner yes share this with your husband share this with your hunker with the male figure i'm i'm just helping relationship a, a qualities and next qualities a woman love to see in her man or in her husband is clear thought clear or clear thought clear clarity of thought which means that you are in a relationship and 
the man can't make a decision in his mind which thought, which what, which way to go, and it will frustrate a lot of ladies. It will frustrate even your partner that you are living with because you don't have a clear thought. They don't know which direction you are going. Right? So clear thought is very important as well. And next quality is a woman love to see in her man. This is very important in him. And it's not everything about Bible. Right? And next quality is a woman love to see in her man is constant communication. Constant communication is very important in relationship. You communicate. Communicate. Constant communication. Which means that if your wife or your woman is at work and you are at work, man, a woman love to see one look at text. Yes, one look at text. One look at messenger. On, I missed you. On, how was your day? How was your day going? Constant communication by a messenger. You don't call her and you don't send a message. Or a normal message to whatever media message. Or constant communication. You can communicate with your spouse even when you're even at work by sending a flowers or sending a rose or sending a chocolate or sending a gift. You are communicating silently, but you are communicating. Uh huh. Also, constant communication as well. You can go to the pharmacy and or wherever uh, send a postcard or leave a postcard um, on the fridge. Um, um, she's sleeping, you leave the, the postcard um, or a card or a love note um, um, in the bathroom where the glass is. You know, she has to brush her teeth, she has to comb her hair. That is constant communication. Right? Also, you can also use the media um, in terms of um, leave a, a love note um, where the makeup is, where 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 our toothbrush is, where our brush is, um, on the pillar, on the bed, wherever it is, on the couch, wherever you know that she has to go there. That is constant communication. It doesn't mean you have to be on the phone all the time. It means you find means and ways to communicate in silently without you literally saying. So a woman loves to see that qualities in her male figure. And as well, constant communication is that you are you are at work, she's at work, and and you can communicate with her silently by bringing her something. Could be a chocolate when you're coming from work, it could be um, something simple right so you communicate with her in that way that when you reach when you give it to her she says oh my man thinking about me my husband thinking about me they crave for them stuff there they look out for them stuff there right so these are some of the stuff them that 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 we can do um as men Right, constant communication. And next qualities that a woman love to see in her man or in her husband is is gentleness of touch. Gentleness of touch. Remember, you know, it's your it's your lady that your woman. It's not all woman love things rough. They love gentleness. You can't grab them a certain way. You can't hold them a certain way. You have to deal with it because they are fragile. You know? Weaker vessel mean weaker in in terms of emotions, not not my physical. Emotion they are weak, so they're looking for a gentle touch. Gentleness of touch. And if you check most of these men, both old and both young, they are too rough. So gentleness is very important that a woman is looking for. Qualities of qualities of a lady or a woman love to see in her man or her husband is is patient to understand you have to understand them be patient with them to understand it if you're not patient you can't understand them if you're not patient with them you will not understand them and 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 it's very important for us to have patience. listen many women think before they have and it's not like we were hot before we think. Men, men, I don't know why, but it's like we're built. 
we act sometimes before we think. But ladies think before they act. So you have to deal with them in a patient manner for you to understand them. They're not complicated, you know. It's just that you're not taking the time out and the patient to understand them. Let me say it again. Ladies are not complicated to understand. But you're not taking the time out to understand them. Relationship or marriage is a job. And I always say this to anybody. Right? Marriage is not, you know, married for comfort. You know, you, you don't marry for comfort. If you want him, if you want comfort, if you want comfort, go buy one puppy. Go buy one go buy one a cat. I go buy one goldfish. If you're married, if you want if you're married for comfort, or you're in a relationship for comfort. You you are in a relationship or trying to spark a relationship for each other to play a role. So relationship or marriage is a role, is a job. You don't want to do it, but you got to do it. You don't want to clean, but you got to clean. It's a rule. So I want you to get that because a lot of you guys missed up when persons get married that it is a comfort. No, if you want comfort, go buy one puppy. Go buy one cat. Go buy one goldfish. Go buy one teddy bear if you want comfort. But when you take up a human being, it is a rule. You have to play a role. Now let's continue here. I hope I clarify that with relationship. Now qualities a woman love to see in her man is that she, or in her husband. Qualities a woman love to love love to see in her man or husband is um she needs to be knowing she is the first in your eyes at all times. A woman love to know that she's the first, not your mother, not your pitney. Whether it's biological or whatever, a woman love to know that she is the first in your eyes. If she don't see that she's the first in your eyes, male or man or husband, you're going to have problem. Let me say it again. A woman love to know that she is the first in your your eyes as a male. If you put her a second, you're going to have a problem. If you put her a third, you're going to have a problem. Get what I'm saying? So, they crave for that. Now, the next qualities a woman love to see in her man or husband eyes is that someone who can keep secret. Now, Remember that a woman lies with you in the bed. Bed. She, she would take you as her partner but also as her friend. Let me say it again. Qualities a woman love to see in her man. That he not chat too much. She no one to see you chat too much. The qualities that she's looking, 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 looking for in her man or in her husband is that he can keep her secret. They can reason together and know say, nah, go road. And now nah, go to your mother. You discuss something with her and now nah, go to the friend. Now nah, the family, now nah, your sister, now nah, your brother, now nah, your cousin, now nah, your friend, now nah, your, nah, your, your ex girlfriend. So they are looking for someone that they can talk to because they take you not as their only their partner, not only as their husband, not only as a man, but they take you as their friend. That in their bad times they can share things with you. Things not going good at work, they know so they have a friend that they can talk to at home who they might lie down with. They know that so this is going to them family family. Uh -huh, they can sit down and talk to you about it. They are looking for it. It's a quality that they are looking for. Right? They know that, hey, I've done some past things in my life and I have a friend that I can share it with. I'm telling you, they are looking for a man that can keep secret, keep their private information, keep 
what they are struggling with. S mm, what they are struggling with, they are looking for that. And if they don't see that, they're going to leave you. Because if you can't trust a man by talking to him, it makes sense you have a relationship with him. Because they go through phases in their lives. They want someone that can keep a secret with, which means that they may go through a, a time of sickness. And they can trust their partner enough. Secret. They know that this happened and that is in the account and that is in the secrets. This happened to my family. My family has been raped or I have been raped or I have been molested. They tell you that secret because they trust you as a male. Uh-huh. To keep that. So, that's what they're looking for. A quality, qualities a woman love to see in, in her man or husband is that he's a provider. How man love to know that, hey, I want a sweetest thing song with some with many ladies that then can big up and say, hey, I want it with my man. He's a great provider. All when we don't see eye to eye, my man is a great provider. He's not lazy. But he do whatever it takes to hold the family together. How man love to see that. Now, a next quality. A next quality is a woman love to see in her man or husband. This is real counseling, I'm telling you. you know. we don't, you have to go to a counselor. We don't, you have to sit in front of a minister. I am counseling you. I am giving you tips. I'm giving you ideas what a woman looking for. Now, qualities a woman love to see in her man is that um, is a, a sense of control. Our qualities a woman love our qualities a lady or a woman love to see in her man or husband is a sense of control. A sense of control. What do you mean? What do you mean? You know of a control yourself in public. Without she have to look by a certain way or she have to you know, you can control yourself. Even when they're at the poolside. Even when they're at the river. Even when they're at the beach. Even when they're at the streets. Even when in the supermarket. You can control yourself. Yes, they're looking for that. Sense of control. They leave you at the home. And expected that, hey, I trust you enough and I know that you can control yourself around my sister, around my auntie, around my best friend, around my co-worker, around my church sisters. So they are looking for a sense of control. Mm -hmm. Now, now, a next quality is a woman, our ladies love, love to see in her man. Our husband is freedom to be without you keeping a watch. Who wanna love when man watch them? Give them freedom, give them space. And you can't stop a woman from cheat if she decided to, to, to cheat. I when you lock her down and say you gotta work. She still can find a way. So you trust her enough. Not to control her because I really, really realize that a lot of male and husband are controlling freaks. So a woman don't like, she love to have a little freedom. Freedom to be without you keeping a watch on them. Watch a man, stop watching a woman. Give her freedom. Same thing goes for the male as well. Woman, stop watching man. With some, give them freedom. Give them a sense. Because why do you in a relationship, why do you marry to somebody and you can't give them, them freedom? Huh? 
If you lock the dog in the dog house for long, you're going to make him sick. But when, as soon as you release that leash from him, if you let him out, he now come back and run all over the place. Freedom is very important, known as space, a little space. Because although you are in the relationship, everybody wants to have their local space. Whether it's to watch TV, whether it's to go out, whether it's to mingle with them friends, whether it's to play a local domino. Same thing with the ladies, them. Ladies, the ladies, they want to look at freedom. They want to have girl stock. Just as just a man want man stock, woman want have girl stock. We don't know, without you playing, you are got age, she are got age, so you have to do it. No. She are got visit her mother, you have to do it. No. Give them them space. Woman want to have them girl talk. I allow my wife to have her girl talk. Go on, go, babes. Because some things that they want to discuss and run, joke and talk with, they don't want man to hear. So a woman love to have that local space. Right? And next thing, qualities a woman love. Love to see in her, share the life. Share the life in groups, share the life in with your friends, with your with your partner, with your friends, with your husband. Share the life, share the life, share the life. If you love what I'm saying, share the life. And let me say, these, these are counseling tips. This is things that can build and to empower your relationship. It's a long list, right? And next quality, um, um, as I read before, freedom to be without you keeping a watch. Every move they make, they don't like that, right? And next quality a woman love to see in her man is that um, consistency. Consistency. Some males are not consistent. They start something but never finish it. They love to see that you're consistency. Mm -hmm. They talk all of one time and that's it. They're not, they're not consistent. They make sure say everything nice up for the one day, but which is the Monday, but Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and, Sat and Saturday to Sunday. It's like in chop of a shape. They're not consistent. So they want consistency. You know what I'm talking about. I'm not talking only sexual intercourse, but I'm also talking otherwise. They want consistency in the relationship. Also, qualities a woman love to see in her man or husband is the dating time. And appreciated. Now, now, let me use it. Dating. Dating is consistent. Even when you're married. You have to keep on dating your partner. Go out. Not because you have a baby. Go out. Not because you may be overseas and working. Because let me say this to you. If you've been working, 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 working. And don't spend time in a relationship. Both of you will die in that relationship. And miserable. And grumpy. And moody. So dating is very important. Important. It could be dating, walking on the street, dating, go buying ice cream, dating, sharing poems together, dating, watching movies together, dating, go and ice shop. I'm talking dating, dating, sitting in the mall together. So it is very important, men. Man, woman love to see that the dating consistency and also appreciated. Now, one of the qualities a woman really love to see is appreciated. She cook a dinner, tell her thanks. She prepare your meal, tell her thanks. And in the same breath, let me say this to you. Men, never you ever know that your wife or your woman is cooking your food and you fool your belly a road. I could have your mother yard, don't fool your belly your mother yard. Or your uncle yard or your father yard. Never you all if your mother cook your favorite meal. Never fool your belly. Always leave back a look room to eat your wife food. You hear? Take it from a wise man. Always leave back room to heed whatever your 
woman cook. Unless you're going in a problem. Unless you're going to in a problem. So, watch that. Because woman not drop memory so easy. And whole and panel look a simple thing there. So, appreciated. Appreciate. When she does things, wash your clothes. Tell her thanks. Only I really and truly appreciate you. Not only by words, but also by action. So they are looking for these things. Seriously. Right? Right? So, so these are situations. I want to say this to you. You see the God that is inside of me? The Jesus Christ that is inside of me is older than man. The, the Jesus Christ that is inside of me is older than man. And he revealed things that my generation has go through. My great, 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 great grandmother, my great, 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 great grandfather. And he bring things into this life because God is inside of me. So he give me experience, he give me knowledge, he give me wisdom. That's why you think the Lord said that my people are destroyed because of a lack of knowledge. Jesus Christ is the teacher of all nations. He is a spirit. God is a spirit. And they that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. And he equipped me with knowledge. Don't watch my youthfulness. Don't watch my youngness. Watch what I'm saying to you to improve lives. Next thing that our females qualities a woman or a lady love to see in her man or husband is a chemistry must be connected. Chemistry is very important in relationship or um, love to see in a man. You go into you seeing a woman dating you and there's no chemistry. There's no connection. So chemistry is very important to be must be connected so a woman is looking for the chemistry in the relationship right qualities a lady love to see in her man or husband is stability you're stabilized right you are stabilized Right, you cannot be moving from one place to one next place, from one job to one next job. Right? Right? You're constantly all over the place. They love to see stability. Stability. Stability is very important in a relationship. Right? Qualities a woman, qualities a lady's love, qualities a lady love to see in her man or husband is quality qualities a woman or a lady love to see in her man is that a clean man and a good hygiene men woman no love to smell when man green a lady love to see when man take time take out the look here then we are each other in, in their ears groom themselves properly me talking real woman here now. Me talking real ladies here. Me talking premium ladies here. Right? A, a quality a woman love to see in her man. This is her man clean. In teeth no yellow. Him out of brushing teeth. In tongue. Bugu. Out of him nose. Him take time taking care of himself. His hygiene. in no smell green. Him always have a good roll on. Good, good, good cologne. In foot no cheesy. They're looking for those. They're looking for those stuff. They're looking for those stuff. Why they're looking for those stuff? Because they love to kiss, kiss pan neck and all of that. They don't want to kiss kiss when the whole is so full of whatever, green like whatever. Right? Ladies love to see when a man mouth fresh. Them nose. Bugo come out of them nose, no matter now they yai. Them nails, them clean. Nails, as simple as nails. Nails, ladies are looking for it. 
said clean and well groomed. They are looking for that. So they love to see when them man clean. Them shoes clean and clothes clean. Well pressed, rest neat. They love to see that because you know why? Because these men represent her. And when the man clean, when you're clean men, eh? Trust me, it brings a sense of joy to them. When you have good hygiene, trust me, your ladies will take off do things for you. Because you're clean. Right? Right? And next quality, uh 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 um Right and and, and and when I'm talking, I'm not out only talking the nails. I'm talking even the toes. The toes them for clean too, you know. Yeah, man, toes them for clean, man. No woman I want when you say when they, you're in at the bed with, with them, you you toe them a crop bar. Toe for clean. Right, ensure that your hygiene is well being taken care of. Good hygiene, right? Qualities a woman love love to see in her man or husband is. Um, um, great emotional support. You can't know that you, your wife, mother die, and you don't support her emotionally. You can't know that your wife, family relative die, and you, you don't support her emotionally. You can't know that she's underneath pressure at work, crying, and you, you don't support her emotionally. Right? You can't know that she's going through a crisis in terms of sickness. And you can't support her emotionally. You can't know that she's going through a trauma in her life. And yeah, you don't support her emotionally. They are looking for a, a, a quality a woman love to see in her man. That you can support her emotionally. You're, you're with her throughout, through thick and thin. True, thick and thin. And next qualities a woman love to see in her, in, 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 in her man is, is, is protective. Qualities a woman love to see in her man or in her husband that he is protective. He is protective of her, of her well-being. Mm hmm how can you say that you are protective and you are leading your woman into danger? How can you say that you are protective and you don't give your woman or your wife heads up to know where she is going around some of your Jezebel family, around your Jezebel co-worker? Right? Protective, which means that you're protecting her, but you're also giving her information that she can be aware of her surrounding. So, qualities a woman love to see in her man or husband is that accepts acceptance for who she is. Qualities a woman love to see in her man, you accept her for who she is. Accept her for who she is. One of the dangerous things that a lot of male does, and also females, males and also females, but I'm dealing with the males. Never you ever compare your wife with other ladies. Never you ever do that. Never you ever compare your woman or your personal your, your 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 personal wife or your personal lady with another woman sexually. Say your ex do it better than her. A wrong thing you ever do in your life. Never you ever do that. You and are in a relationship, you must can come to an agreement to ex to, 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 to teach each other to and let me say this to you. Don't assume, male, that she know. Don't assume that she know, but tell her. This is what you like. This is what you don't like. Same thing goes for the woman. Right? Let's see how best that we can work at this. But don't assume that you know. Because a lot of ladies, a lot of wives are very inexperienced. They have never 
go through a lot of experience in their life, but you may be more experienced male. So teach her. Yes, a woman loves to know that her man is in control. Not control in terms of controlling her, but all control by giving her experience, giving her teaching. Teach her things that she never know. And be patient with it. Because she's not going to learn overnight. Some women learn slow, some women learn fast. Take her time, take your time with them. Mm -hmm. Well, let me give you a typical example. It's not everybody, it's not every female male is, it is, it's not every woman that is educated. So not because you may be educated, the qualities that is inside of you, you're going to educate her or help her to reach up to your level. Same things, you may know how to do some house chores, right? You teach her. You don't judge her, you don't condemn her, you don't compare her with your mother. Never you ever compare your woman with your mother. That means if that means you did not want a wife, you want a mother. So if you don't want a mother, then that means you should have married to your mother. And that would be incest. So don't compare your mother with your personal woman or with your wife. Right? Qualities a woman loves to see in her husband or in her man. Is that some sense of intelligence? A woman love to know that hey, want to work my man you know him intelligent. Brilliant panda. You can't you can't trick him. They are looking for some sense of intelligence. Qualities a woman love to see in her man. Right? Is a sense of independence. Which means that independent that, that means uh, you don't have to depend upon her. So that means say, independence doesn't mean that because you can have money. I'm not looking at that. I'm looking more upon a deeper core of independence. Which means that she leave gone overseas. But you are so independent enough to take care of yourself by probably cooking your food. Without inviting your ex to come cook for you or invite your mother to come cook for you. She loves to know that you can be so independent that you can take care of yourself and she don't have to be burdened down. And I'm not talking money here. She don't have to be burdened down. Mm -hmm. The next quality a woman loves to see in her man that he is kind if you can't kind to people then oh you're going to be kind to her kindness how can you know that you are getting involved with uh um with a woman or involved with your wife and you're you're, you're you are not kind to her other children or outside children that she has Think about it. They are looking for that. Qualities a woman love to see in her man? Hmm? That is passion. They want this passionness coming from you. Qualities a woman love to see in her man? To make her laugh. And not every woman is like every other woman. But at the end of the day, end of the day, even if your woman is serious and she doesn't laugh with people outside and she doesn't laugh with her family outside, she wants to know that her partner or her man or her husband can make her laugh. Or put a smile on her face. So a woman loves to know that her man can make her laugh. Make her jovial. Yes. That she can put down that wall that she has built up. Mm -hmm. That wall that she has built up, she wants to know. She wants to know. Right? A second thing that um, a quality a woman loves to see in her man or in her husband is that he show interest in her hobbies. 
Yes. Show interest in her hobbies. She like to watch. You may not like to watch in terms of um um show interest. My wife said good morning. Bless the Lord, everybody. They're not. They're not seeing you. Bless the Lord, everybody. <laughs> yes. That's my wife. <laughs> uh, yes. Right? Um, so, a woman love to see the qualities. Um, a woman love to, love to see the qualities in a man that, that show interest in her hobbies. Now, and are you alone of hobbies, man? You may love football, but you may love soap proper. Right? You may love um, cricket, but she may love ballet. Now, the same way that show interest, you may not like it. You may not like netball, but sit and watch with her. Try and understand it. Huh? You may know hobbies that she like. You may not like, sh she may like chess. Sit and watch it. She may like to watch um, romantic movies. Sit with her and watch it. Buy one popcorn too. You will learn something. You will learn something that you know learn from her all these times that you know as 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 has been involved. So 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 show interest in her hobbies. She love that. Sometimes she doesn't want her friend. You know? She don't want her sister. She doesn't want her mother. She doesn't want her co-worker. She wants you to show the interest in her hobbies because she take you as her best friend, as her friend, as her powering P. Show interest. Now, qualities a woman love to see in her man is that um, pampering from time to time. Every woman love pampering. Yes, man. Pampering. From time to time. Every woman love pampering. She come from a hard work. Right? She come from a hard work. Hard. She stand up on her feet. Right? Prepare the board for her. She come from a hard work. Right? Ask her how is her day. Get something to rub her feet, rub her shoulder, play with her mind, make she relax. Pampering. Mm -hmm. Prepare the meal for her, cook for her. Get some non, non alcohol wine, prepare something nice for her. Pampering. Pampering. Help her come out her here. Pampering. Woman love pampering from time to time. Mm -hmm. Pampering. So, you have to look out for that. Um, so, a woman, every woman love it, yeah? Men, every woman love pampering. So, qualities a woman love, love to, 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 to see in her man or husband is commitment. If you're committed to buy something, they are looking for it. Never commit. Not only committed mean committed in the relationship. It's that, not, not, not only looking at, at your uncle seeing her alone and not cheating her around. Committed with your words. Not only with your action, but also with your words. And also with your action. Because you can commit it with your words, but the action doesn't line up with your words. So that means that if you committed to her that you're going to get her this cologne or this nice skirt or this name brand don't promise something that you can't fulfill please they are looking for it so if you promise them this or that they are looking for it so if you promise them in january them them start reminding from this from 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 November. Them start get int. They now tell us say we oh, promise them you know, they might get int. They might put you upon your guard say hey, 
Remember, say you promised me something for January, you know. But then start telling a certain, you know, look, psychology way. If you drag your memory, if you drag back your thought. I'm telling you how them stay. Right? So, commitment is very important. Both verbally and also physically. Action. Qualities a woman or a lady love to see in her man or in her husband. How they can solve problems or issues fast. Woman love to see how fast a man can solve a problem or issues. They like cut off, but then try to find a way if you go solve it, you know, say it pee. Right? Certain sickness pops up and your woman have to take a surgery and don't have the money to pay. Right? Then wants to see how fast or quick or how the extent you can will will go to ensure that the surgery money has been paid. I'm just giving you an example. Right? So they want to see how fast you can solve problems or whether it's minor or whether it's major problems or issues fast. They want to know. Right? Now, qualities a woman love to see in her man is that how you speak to them, whether it's in private or public. You have to begin to know how you speak to your woman or speak to you. So qualities a woman love love. Qualities a lady love to see in her man or in her husband is that how you speak to them, whether it's in private or public. So if you speak to them harsh at home, how will you learn at home? You're going to put it in the public space. And let me tell you something, men, vice versa, but I'm dealing with the men them here. If you speak to them a certain way, harsh, in private and get away. You know, must get away when you do it in a public. Let me say it again. If you speak certain harsh word with to them in private, you know, must get away. When, any, when, any, when you do the same harsh word in public, you will get a different reaction. So begins to format your words, formalize your words, right? Ensure that your words don't create harm or damage or extended damage. Let me use it again because you can get angry. But extended damage that you can't recover because whatever you speak out of your mouth, you can't catch it back. So if you call a, a word raggedy in your in your in towards your lady like she's a gal, she's a skatel, or she's a whore, or she's a pra don't wanna feel like so she'll forget it. And these are some of the stuff that push a lot of ladies to go out. Because they they can't take the verbal abuse anymore. So choose your word, men. So qualities that woman love to love love to see in her man or in her husband is that you have to choose your words carefully. How you deal with them. Privately and also publicly. Qualities a woman love to see in her man. Right? Having fun to make good memories together. Woman love qualities a lady. Real woman love to see in her man or husband. Hmm? Having fun and to make good memories together. You know why they look for the great the good memories? Having fun, laughing, smiling, enjoying life. Time with pan or man. Whether you're great or whether you're simple. So, when you're in a relationship, have fun. Have fun. Why am I saying this? Because there's going to be a time in your life that when sickness holds you, you can't have that fun, but you can have the memories to draw back on. Have fun together and make great memories together. Whenever you have problems, those great memories, those great fun time that both of you have, have, have triumphed over will come in place in during those issue time. 
Me not give up on my man because we have some great memories together. We go through thick and thin. And, and, and yes, we may not see eye to eye. We, we, we may not see eye to eye because we are two different individuals. But we have great fun together. We share things together. So having great memories is very important. Taking pictures together, very important. Making great um, um, videos together, very important. Sometimes we, even when you're married, uh, um, um, from time to time, don't wait till your anniversary, right? You sit down and you watch back your wedding. You watch back your weddings. I'm just giving you a tip. If you are married, men, it's good to babes come together let's look on the wedding pictures them right look how you start off because sometimes issues arise and you have to take back your memory or take back your your spiritual man back into a little bit of past to show how where you both are coming from and you can't give up and you can't go into divorce or you can't break up the relationship because we spend so much time together investing because relationship is also investing in each other i spend on my wife my wife spend on me right we spend on each other so much because we invest relationship is investment right why you think because it's time both of you spending time five year four year six year two year together that's time you spend together so you invest in each other right and you use that to build your life we invest in terms of buying property together buying a piece of land together right buy a car together we invest we share things together right because relationship is sharing on you take the car this morning i take the car in the night we share it on something comes up i will pick you up because your car is down sharing the investment if you're not willing to share investment with each other don't get married I don't care who you are. If you're a mean man or a mean woman. If you don't plan to share investment together, don't get married. Don't go and live alone. If you don't plan to invest, both of you, man investing in, in, in a woman or in his wife, and a wife or a woman invest in his man or husband. If you don't plan to invest in both, in vice versa, don't go in a relationship. Just as a relationship or marriage is not, you don't married for comfort. You're married for a role or a job. Marriage is a role and a job. Through sickness, through health, through death, those part. You're still playing a role when you're sick. We're still playing a role when you're sick. We still when you we're in health, which means we're still playing the role. It's a role. It's a job. Job means I'm constantly improving and I'm constantly learning. Relationship or marriage is a job. J O B. I'm. Why am I saying this? You may be in a nine to five. You know, one go work, but you have to go. Rain or fall, but you still have to go work. Sun or shine, you still have to go work. Snow or fall, you still have to go work. The water cut off, but you still have to go work. Because in your mind, you have to earn the money. Same thing with relationship. It's a job. Me no want to cook, but me have to cook. Me no want to wash, but me have to wash. Me no want to go out tonight with my wife and my husband, but me have to go. I'm just explaining it's a job. It's a role. If you don't ready to go into a relationship with a role or a job, don't go. If a comfort you want, buy a teddy bear, buy a goldfish, by a cat and live till you're dead. Let me say, let me say it again. If you want to marry for comfort, for comfort, hmm? buy one cat, buy one dog, I want puppy, I want goat, I want fowl, I want goldfish, I want teddy bear, and live with them there till you're dead. Don't marry Miss Matty Boy Pitney. Don't marry the sister brown girl child. Left them alone. Cause it's a role, it's a job, and we totally forget say it's a role and job. Let's continue here. Qualities a woman love to see in her man or husband. Um, qualities a woman love to see in her man or husband is that he always speak about her 
good qualities in and out of our presence. Now, I would love to hear that. I, I one of the sweetest things for many women when time them man or them husband just speaks about one thing with my one thing with my woman, you know, one thing with, with my wife. And the best thing seen slice burn. She she's not there. Right? And talk around our family say, oh great this woman is. My God, the best, best that, I mean, when you leave and that auntie or that mother or that friend and that co-worker buck your wife and roll, I say one thing with your man, you know. He never big you up all when you salt the rice. He not said salt. You must say the best thing. Woman love to hear that. They are looking for that, that, that big up. Not only in prob not only in private, but also in public. When you have big them up. And then go on the street and then hear about it. Because you can't big up in a private and a big up in a public. Just a word of encouragement. Qualities a woman loves to see in her man or husband is that um always uh, um always uh, a call or a text text her when she don't expect it call her and text her when she don't expect it they are looking for that they are looking for that qualities a woman love to see in her man or husband right it's um um always active in loving her always active in loving her qualities that woman love 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 to see in her manner her husband the love is always active loving her loving her why am i saying that your wife shoes dirty you can't wipe it after you know yeah man you love her that your wife clothes dirty you can go wash them too you know you don't have to on her. Active love, loving her. Active loving her. You spread the bed. I still love her. I love her. No? Mm -hmm. You sweep the yard. Not because you're a man. Tidy the house. Yes, man. Let me get a typical word of encouragement. My significant leave and go, my wife leave and go um, off the island, overseas. And she spent a while, a quite weeks off the island. And when she come back, can't believe that's what it was pretty. A wash, a wash. A spread the bed, a white floor, mm -hmm. set the bed in like a hotel. Yeah, man, spread the bed in like a hotel with it. Ensure that every window wiped down. I'm just teaching you. Mm -hmm. Ensure that her clothes is well neat, put away. Come here, fool them to you. Know. I just put them down, I fool them. And place with it, with it, place. Ensure that the bathroom is clean. Ensure that the kitchen is clean. Ensure that the toilet is clean. Come in, come in, just, just we come, come preach. I tell you what me, what me do. And I ensure that the house is well fresh. That if food, something drop on the ground, you can take it up and eat it. The last thing that I do is prepare her meal before she reach back to the island. When she come, she can't believe say how this how the house looks so. Because I my love is constantly active. My love is constantly active. I'm not just saying it, but I'm putting it in the action. I did not ask anybody if you come and make house. If you come, come clean. Our pay one made if you come, come clean. I do it myself. 
I do it myself. Ensure that the coaches them are wiped. Ensure that there is no dust on the dinner table. Ensure that the fridge is clean. I'm just telling you the extent that I go. Ensure that the room is well set, well lit. It's when my wife come, because my love is constantly active. Me not just call her and say, on, me love you. Or, me, me miss you. Me start put it in action because your words have to back up with your action. When she comes, she wonders. She can't blow her mind. Because I'm putting in the work. I'm putting in the work. When she finish eat, me have to wash back plate. Not because I I want to do it. I need to do it because want is as is different from need. I need to do it for my relationship to last. I have to put in the work as a man. So I've done that. And that helped the relationship. So ladies are looking for the qualities like these things. I don't care what you want me to say. I'm just teaching you something. Because I am be honest to you, let me stick up in right here. I am tired of counseling and helping and motivating a lot of people who relationship just go down like that for simple things. So I decided, say, Lord, I want you to give me the knowledge that I can help to empower empower men empower men and also empower relationship now qualities a woman love to see in her man qualities a woman love to see in her man is that keeping out helping out in the home sorry <clears throat> qualities a woman love qualities a woman or a lady love to see in in a man or husband is that he always helping in the home female are tired as well it's not easily doing house chores or housework it takes a lot to move the furniture them it takes a lot to move the bed to sweep from behind the fridge behind the stove it takes energy to pull these things forward when you are not around men. So the ladies like to see when a man can help out in the home as well. It helps to bring a sense of she is not a slave, but she is a lover for you. And a lot of ladies feel like they are a slave. And then that is what breaks a lot of marriages, a lot of relationships. They want to feel a sense that both of you guys are in a relationship she doesn't marry to a slave driver qualities a woman love to see in her man or in her husband let's continue here right is vulnerability emotion as an as a man a woman love to see is vulnerability emotions Man, I want to cry, but it's good to cry at times. And I saw yourself, but a lady want to see that side of you. When things not go right, I me cry and I holler at my wife hands. I don't do it in the public. Because I'm a friend, I'm a power in peace, I'm a power, I'm a walk. Even when I don't see eye to eye. But she loves to see that tenderness. Not that ego mentality, that softness, that soft side of you. It do helps. Because why? Because when a man keep up so much inside of them, they will hurt the woman. When a man buckle up all this pain and hurt, they will hurt their wife and they will hurt their woman or their lady. Why? Because everything buckle up inside of them. And because they doesn't cry and release that tenderness of emotion. 
Yes. And that's how when you cry, you are releasing the tension. That pain, that hurt, that rejection. And that is the truth. So a woman loves to see that vulnerability emotion from a man. So they can know how to deal with that tenderness with a man. You feel disappointed a man hold it in your heart. Mother hurt him, he hold it. Co-work and friend hold it. And he pile up in him and he lock down and he keep silent like himself and he kill off himself. And he will kill you too. And this, this is how murder suicide comes in. I'm helping somebody. So it's good when a man can cry. Now tell if you cry regular like a girl. But it's good when he can shed tears emotionally and release what is bothering him on the inside. Sometimes the only way when a man you will ever see a man cry is when a woman done left and gone and my ball pan for phone like and knows what I run. That's the only thing you see some man cry. I beg for the woman to come back. It's too late. It's too late. Then that's why God sent me here this morning to help you guys. Qualities that woman love to see in her man. But I'm helping you guys. If you notice that I don't really quote no scriptures. I'll wear my bubble inside of me. But because I felt led to teach you guys these things. Qualities a woman love to see in her man or in her husband. Right? A woman want to know that their opinion is valid or validated. Qualities a woman qualities a woman or a lady love to see in her man or her husband is that a woman love to know that her, her opinion is valid and validated. She wants to know that she has a voice. Not because you are the man, she wants to know that her opinions, you listen to her opinions as well. She wants to know that when she speaks to you, hey, don't see X, Y, Z. Not because she, she wants you to stay far from this person. It's because she sees certain things or certain things as reach her ears. And she's saying, hey, listen to what I'm saying, a man, don't go there. Not because you, you have a friend and you're, you're giving. Your friend, she want to know that her opinion is validated, valid and validated because what? Because she is guiding you from self-destruction. Not because she doesn't fix a car. But listen to her. She may have a reason not to fix it. Someone is stubborn and go fix the car when she tell her to sell the car. Your woman opinion supposed to be so validated that she had tell you say hey Ewa, don't fix the car you're not going to waste your money just sell the car and done and let's see how best that we can work towards helping to buy one new car why no you know don't want to listen to your woman opinion and you don't want to violate uh, 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 um, agree with it so you go fix it and it costs you a harm on a leg. So her opinion, she wants to know that her opinion, opinion is valid and validated by you. She loves to see that in a man. It's not always, we're always right. Now, qualities a woman loves to see in her man or in her husband is that uh, um, awareness. Aware of your surrounding you can't be so na naive woman opinion should be count in a relationship it's never a one side remember that God sent not a maid nor a footstool but an help maid you help him with great opinion help maid you help your man with great opinion great advice be great business plan. Help 
made. People don't understand what the Bible means by help me. It make heave as help me to Adam for a reason. Women see things a lot to be more clearer than some man. Help mate. Help mate. Help with the advice. Help to direct the business plan. Help with the account. Help with how you we can buy a piece of land together, buy a house together, buy a car together. Help mate. Help. Help. Help with even the opinion that you have. Help, mate. Not foot mate. Not back, back mate. Not a maid. Help, mate. Which means help with opinion. Awareness. Awareness is the next qualities that a woman is looking for in a man. Awareness. You have to be aware of your surrounding. Which I've discussed earlier before. Now, an next quality is a woman love to uh, love to see in her man is curiosity. Curiosity and courteous. Why she make that emotional decision? A lot of persons, a lot of females will make um, emotional decisions. Some may work out, some may work out. But emotional decisions, because a lot of females come with some emotional decisions. And they need a man opinion. They don't need, they don't, they don't need nobody opinion. They need your opinion. Emotional decisions. It could be a decision is to... Um, you could have kids together before they do them studies or wait first um them studies at first and then they do them them um the kids after so these are emotional decisions that needs to be planned out and uh, decisions in terms of who's going to keep the kids um after a certain time these are decisions that needs to uh, 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 um, um validate by both of you mean coming in coming to an agreement by both of you so these are decisions so i call that um, um emotional decisions a woman love to see that her man is there with her with her emotional decisions could be right it could be wrong two heads is better than one an ex qualities a woman or a lady love to see in her man or husband is leadership skill yeah, we have to learn leadership skill in this manner as man as husband leadership skills is very very important we have to lead man was born to manage man was born to manage we have to learn to manage our life a lot of stuff destroy our our lives together because we are so occupied by jobs and you're running down the money and forget about the relationship I say to a couple that I was talking to I said that you can be right as a man and you can win the war but lose the relationship you can win what your wife is saying but it can mash up the really you know you're, not, you're no longer going to have a relationship so you can win the war but lose the relationship is that a serious purpose you know you can win the war But lose the relationship because you're right and you're always right it's not always the right thing is the wise thing to do i may be right or my wife may be right and but it's not because she is right or me is right 
is wrong timing you have to pick your timing wisely you have to pick the location wisely to discuss the issues the problems going forward i hope you learn a lot i have spent a lot of details trying to help relationship trying to help marriage trying to help um relationship that is ending up in divorce i spend a lot a lot a lot a lot right i spend a lot and let me say this to you our next qualities that i, 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 I is we have to learn to compromise i may be right but compromise to save the marriage we have to do what we have to do and let me say this foremost there's no perfect man out there there's no perfect woman out there god no met them yet there is no perfect relationship out there no matter how you may see look you're going to have ups you're going to have down there is no perfect man out there there is no perfect woman out there them they don't make yet or there is no mr right Cause Mr. Right mean perfect. Our Mr. Right woman out there, them don't make yet. When you enter into a relationship, people is going to carry them baggage. Everybody have a pass. Everybody have a pass. Woman have a pass. Man have a pass. Everybody have baggage. But the question is to ask how you deal with the baggage as an next individual. When you go to the market, you go with your market with your money and with your bag empty. And when you buy the yam, the banana, you name the, the cocoa, the bag become heavy. It become what? Heavy. What do you choose? You choose to what? To leave it there? Or to pay somebody to help you? If you can't manage with too heavy bag that can strain you. What am I saying is that I have baggage. I come with baggage because I'm not perfect. My wife come with baggage. But I choose to help her by holding one side with her baggage so we can solve the baggage. So we can work the relationship together. So the relationship don't no longer become a strain or a burden. But the relationship become light because both of us are helping to carry the baggage together. Or carry the bag together. I love you all. Send this out. Go over it. You will learn a lot. This may can't help everybody. Don't watch my youthfulness. Because the God that is inside of me is older than man. I have, a, I have a lot of experience. By physically and also by God teaching me this knowledge. I depend on the Holy Ghost to teach me these things. Don't never you ever compare your relationship with other relationships. Never you ever compare your marriage with other marriage. Never compare your marriage with your sister marriage. Never compare your marriage with your mother marriage. Because every relationship, every marriage is different. All if you're born as a twin, you are different. All if you're born as a triplet, you will be different. Relationship is what you make it. Marriage is what you make it. My wife begins to understand me. I begins to understand my wife. I know what she like, what she don't like. I know what is boundaries because in marriage or in relationship, and this is an next quality that a lot of women love, love to see in, in her man life, vice versa. Is boundaries. You must know your boundaries. That you take with people. Boundaries. Woman love to see when a man have boundaries. And man love to see when a woman have boundaries. Boundaries. 
you don't cross certain line. Even if you don't cross certain line even with your own partner. I know what you like, what you don't like, what she's looking for, what we get are irritated. Oh, I know. Because I don't come to only to know my significant good side. I want to know her bad side. I want to know her moody side. I want to know what trigger her. I want to know her just as though you have sinus. If you have sinus and you, and you go around, when you run dust, you have to sneeze. If you go around certain hardware and working on hardware, because if you have sinus bad and you're working to an hardware, an hardware or a lumber shop is going to check your sinus. Or if you go working on a dusty place. What am I saying is that you must know your partner what to chigger them off. What they don't like. What they don't want to see around. Who they don't want to see around. You have to learn these things if you want your relationship to go. Qualities. A real woman. Qualities. A real lady. Love to see in her man be aware of things that destroy your marriage or your relationship the same phone where you hug up same password where you put on your phone where you don't want nobody to answer the same phone where you want to meet your little friend them or your little ex and you tell them man lie people marry to them phone them sleep with them phone on their bedside than even a woman. Them woman, the the husband there in the bed or the wife there in the bed and they sleep with the phone on the bed. The first thing they get up on the phone. Or the on the phone. Yeah, do you think I'm joking? Second thing, work. You're full of work too much, man. You run on the world. You run on money and money run from you. No matter how all you are working. It can also destroy your relationship. So phone can mash up your relationship. Work can mash up your relationship. Also, what can mash up your relationship? Your families. Your families can mash up your relationship. Be aware of it. And next thing that can help to mash up your relationship is your friends. Your friends. Your friends don't like how oh, your husband or your man treat you so then get jealous. I'm just helping you. The next thing that can mash up your 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 marriage is your animal. You love your animal more than all you love your your man, or you love your animals more than all you love your wife. Secondly, again, what can mash up your relationship if you don't be aware of is your kids or your step. Children's can mash up your relationship. Yep. And next thing, don't forget church members too. They can mash up your mind. They, they can mash up your relationship. And finally, is pride and money. You love money so much that you forget about the relationship. You run down vanity. You run down because you run down fame and popularity. And spotlight. And you're greedy for money so much. That you don't realize that no matter how much money that you're giving the woman. It never mount up to nothing. Because she's looking for not the money but the man. The real man that is in it. The man. God bless you. Until next time. This is your man servant here. Enlighten you about what qualities a woman love to see in her man or in her husband i hope and trust that this will motivate and help you guys so that you can have a healthy 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 relationship if you really love this send up some heart send up some love send up where your location is and god bless you only thing that i desire of you is your prayer any life that has been set up with my picture with my name begging you with cash up zell 
our bank accounts. That's not me. I don't use Zelle. I don't use PenPal. I don't use Cash Apps. And I don't use bank account. But any one of my lives. Or message somebody privately in their messenger or, or any other platform. Begging them. Or what they can win. That's not me. Everything that I preach or teach is free. Freely I give and freely you shall receive. The only thing that I desire from you guys is just your prayer. Just pray for me that I continue to inspire you guys with these materials. Because it's only my great integrity and my legacy which is my the frame that you are seeing and the wisdom and the knowledge from God and God's glory will be manifested through these lives. God bless you. God bless you. You can watch the life over. You will learn a lot. As I said before, I don't beg money. I don't put up these things to gain, to gain fame or popularity. I just want people to have a healthy life, a healthy relationship, and to live a great Christian life. Nothing more, nothing less. Too much negative in this world for me to focus on negative. I want to focus on something good. I hope you learned a lot. Many times I try to teach this, and it just go like, bam. The life just go dead. But nevertheless, I finally get the chance to empower you guys. As 1 Corinthians chapter 9, I think it's verse 2. I may not be an apostle to others, but I am an apostle to you. Lord, I send a pastor of my own heart. Jeremiah chapter 3, verse 15. I will give you a pastor of my own heart, of his own heart, to feed you with wisdom and knowledge so that my people who are lack of knowledge shall not perish, but I want them to have life and life abundantly. Keep on praying for my strength. There is so much thing that I wanted to enlighten you guys. But God bless you. Until next time. Bless you, my daughters. Bless you, my sons. Bless you. Share the life with friends, family, colleagues, your bishop, your, your, your pastor, your, your evangelists, your missionaries. Share it with them. Share this life. Trust me, they will be empowered. Share it with your husband. You can't talk to him at home? Share this life. Make him listen to a man. Man to man talk this. And trust me, you will have a healthy relationship. I hope next time I'll teach what, what a man qualities a man love to see in a woman. That's part two. It's a part two. Qualities a man love to see in a woman. I will be back one day with that. According to the leading of the Holy Ghost. I can't come upon life unless the Lord lead me. Because I have to at times I have to go. In my secret chamber to get a word from God. As many times you guys may say, but I know the wordy. And every time I get a word. That's why I can't understand how people live on Facebook 24-7. Me can't do it. Because when do I have time to spend with God? I have to spend time with God. For God to enlighten me what where and what should I go. And I can't teach a topic unless God allow me to teach it. God bless you. Until next time, in Jesus' name, bless you. This is a man servant serving the people of God with spiritual food in Jesus' name.